Northwestern and the Spartans of Michigan State. A big one for both of these teams as we hit the home stretch of the season. Lost Ty Berry for the season. Ryan Langborg has been out the two games prior to this one tonight. He, he has just had to plug holes, and what a job he's done. This should be a very entertaining ball game here tonight on senior night. Of course, he has him right now as an eight seed. Langborg, deep three. Well, that's a good sign. I, I think that ankle's feeling okay. Yeah, well, welcome back, Ryan Langborg. Hasn't played in two games, and now a Spartan turnover. Langborg, or Barnheiser rather, giving it to Langborg. There's Martinelli. He cleans it up. Tate through Nicholson, Preston, and Hunger, but they no longer have that luxury. Here's Tyson Walker from 18 feet. He's been doing that all season long. Northwestern had Ty Berry putting up over 20 points in that game as well, and now he's lost for the season. Into the shot clock, Walker. What a circus shot off the window. But there's games where they've been really poor. Martinelli, pretty good pass there from Blake Preston. Yeah, Michigan State in scramble mode there, and great awareness. Preston, a little touch pass to set the table for Martinelli down low. Awaiting our first media timeout. The Langborg injury, now the Nicholson injury they've been dealing with. A lot of dribbling here. Not much movement for Northwestern. So, hey, hey, when you make shots, <laughs> as we've made our way to the end of these seasons, and even though the years are so long, there's still so much undecided. Martinelli getting to his spot. Back to that left hand. His spot is anywhere inside that paint. Here with 10 to shoot. Michigan State's pretty stagnant here. There's just not much ball movement. It's a nice drive, though. Malik Hall catching, ripping, and go, and right down that right lane line. And then the men head to Minneapolis next week. Bowie, step back three, rattles down. Well, you go under on those handoffs, and Boo Booey's going to make you pay for it. A couple games ago, where they just made it a total grinded out affair. Strong finish with a left by Tyson Walker. Tyson Walker. Finding Hogar to the baseline. Good pass. There's Holloman. Got it. And a cut right there by A.J. Hogar. He's got a full head of steam. What a pass. Got Bowie an open look. Brooks Barnheiser. Beautiful. Well, you, you in the Big Ten in conference play and three-point field goal percentage. Knocking another one down. But then the answer again is Holloman. The game on Saturday, but he, he does look much better, and that's that's a big development for Northwestern. And it was only 10 days ago that he sprained that right ankle against Michigan. Martinelli, that left hand again, 11 second difference, shot and game clock, Bowie. And now it'll be in the corner, a three for Brooks Barnheiser. Michigan, what he wanted, also stressed to me that AJ Hogarth. Had to play better here in the second half, and again, right off the bat, he has. Well, that's what Tom Izzo certainly wants, but Luke Hunger has also got to give some sort of resistance. But two possessions here for Michigan State, and two drives to get into that painted area. Do on Saturday, into the shot clock, Martinelli leaning, tapped up. Martinelli got it back, and that one drops. Those are not easy shots, but they are for him. Creating that lane, and what we saw in that first possession is exactly what he wanted. Also stressed to me that A.J. Hogarth had to play better here in the second half, and again, right off the bat, he has. Well, that's what Tom Izzo certainly wants, but Luke Hunger has also got to give some sort of resistance. But two possessions here for Michigan State, and two drives to get into that painted area. Story, Drew. as they work it around to Holloman. 15-footer, yes! Four-point lead. That ball is popping for Michigan State. Dribble drive, extra passes. And he is having a big, big second half. And Dan Lorenzo developed early onset dementia a long time ago as Blake Smith puts in the layup. Dementia, what a battle it's been. That family's been through a lot. Here is Malik up with a left and in. Walker splitting, kicking, Holloman, short, rebound to Walker. In the corner, boy, they could use it, and Barnheiser knocks it down. That's what yours. Barnheiser with eight, along with eight rebounds. Hogarth, though, gets it.
gets right around him on the other end. Seven games. He drives, puts it up, and that one drops down and quiets him. But the, I, mean, I, I think it really threw Malik Hall off. He was looking to be a passer, and he had one-on-one -on -one coverage. And now Boo Boo, he's starting to get into a bit of a rhythm. Keeps the pivot foot. Look at Booker's long arm. And now Walker right down Broadway. Oh, boy. Falling out of bounds. Turnover. Walker lays it in. Bowie splits the defenders high oh, off the glass. First of 50 wins. <laughs> Walker. Then breaks the field goal drought. In this second half. Walker, two more. And he has it stripped. Martinelli got it from him. A minute left, Langborg. Huge three from Ryan Langborg. Now they're going to look to see if his foot was on the line. Bowie's got it. Hands to Langborg. Missed it. Look at the battle for the board. It's absolute carnage, and it's a foul on Northwestern. Get it up quick. Drives. Missed it. Tapped out. That'll do it. The Spartans win it on senior night. Boy, these two teams laid it all on the line tonight. It wasn't a thing of offensive beauty, but these squads battled, and Tom Izzo's crew ekes out a win. One that they had to have, and you're right. Both teams competed. They played incredibly hard. Shots certainly were not falling.